Hello and welcome to Allie's Health Challenge week number five. Before I begin, I'd like to make a quick reminder to keep the emails to me coming. Don't forget it's allie.beheard.fitness at gmail.com. This week's segment is not going to focus on the traditional aspects of getting fit, like working out and eating right. Today I will be talking about how the way you think affects your health in bigger ways than you could have ever imagined. Could it be true? Could a state of mind help one recover from a paralyzing injury? February's edition of Newsmax magazine published a story about an amazingly optimistic woman by the name of Judy Rubens. Her story? She was always a shining and optimistic person, even when a surgery in 2008 resulted in her being paralyzed from the waist down. This course of events would leave most people in despair, drenched in a pool of self-pity. But not Judy. Her optimism never faltered, and she overcame the paralyzation and is now even more grateful for the gift of walking and life to this day. There have actually been studies that have researched the correlation between positive thought and your health. At the University of Kentucky, it was found that when students were more optimistic, their immune systems got stronger. And also, Dutch researchers discovered that among 1,000 senior citizens, the most optimistic had a 55% lower chance of dying from any cause. Studies in general say that optimistic thought will have these following effects on your health. Longer life, less depression, increased immunity, lower levels of stress, better mental well-being, better coping skills, and an overall healthier you. So what does it mean exactly? to be positive and optimistic and in thought. Make sure to shine a positive light on all of your thoughts. For example, Newsmax provided a couple of ways to turn your negative thoughts around. A negative thought, my life is too busy. A positive spin, I set my own priorities. It is time to re-examine my commitments. Another negative thought, why does life always have to be so difficult? A positive spin, life is easier if I take it one step at a time and ask for help along the way. So don't forget to have a good sense of humor. Be willing to laugh and find joy. Surround yourself with positive people. Like my mom always said, you are who your friends are. And be nice to yourself. Never put yourself down. Always be encouraging. Changing your mindset is easy. It just takes the conscious effort to make sure that you're looking at the bright side. Who would have thought that the change in thought could make such a huge difference in your health? Smile, breathe, and think happy things. And next week, join me to look at how you can be vegetarian and be very healthy. And now, over to Keevan with a special Skype guest, Key Club International President, Zin Lee.